Well, as you can see, the cleanup process has begun. This is all from the front yard, some from the backyard. It looks like we're actually have the worst of it in the neighborhood. There's no other big piles down there or down there. There's one little tiny pile right there. Unfortunately, we are still without power. Us and like a good chunk of the city is still without power. Um, SCE and G, which is like our power company, they told somebody down the road earlier that they're not expecting to get power completely restored for a whole week. That is crazy. <laughs> Clearly there's some like major infrastructure that got taken down or something. We've still got that tree laying across our power line. So we probably won't get power until that's taken care of and there's no telling when that's gonna happen. The good news is, and I totally forgot to mention this yesterday, but the garage is perfectly fine. Obviously there's no power, so it's pretty dark in here. But the water didn't even barely make it past the garage. It made it to about right there. So the knife wheel, the wall, everything is perfectly okay. So that's good news because it means I won't have to do a bunch of repairs or anything before Halloween. But uh, yeah, so pretty much we just have to keep ourselves entertained. I'm still out of work. Uh, I went in earlier this morning to do some post-hurricane cleanup over there, picked up some branches. Luckily, uh, my workplace did not sustain any damages or anything. But there's no power, so we can't operate. So, I'm getting like an extra long vacation, I guess. Pretty much I'm keeping my phone charged using my car. Every time it starts to get low, I just go out there, crank up my car, and use my car charger to <laughs> plug it in. Because right now this phone is my only source of entertainment. I can't even work on anything because there's no power. So for one, I can't see. And for two, I wouldn't be able to like turn on any power tools or anything. So. Like, I'm at a standstill as far as all this stuff goes. I still need to make the ticket sign for the ticket booth, but I can't because I need the hot knife to cut it. I need the saw and stuff to, yeah. So we're at a standstill, like life has come to a halt, but at least we still have life. My face, that was weird looking. Um, not to sound too cliche, too cheesy, but we are very fortunate that nobody got hurt around here or anything. Um, so that's what's most important. But anyway, yeah, I'm probably just gonna give you guys these one take updates for every day up until we get power restored. I am still like vlogging like normal, it's just I can't sit down and put it all together for a while. Uh, but anyway. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.